My name is Gertrude Melnikov, but my friends call me Gertie. I took my vows in 1981, and I have lived at St. Mary's Parish ever since. This has been my life's calling, following the humble path of God, and I have felt complete satisfaction until last December when the parish decided to install the internet. And that's when I found sisterspeak.com. And for the first time in my life, I found a connection to the outside world. I met a nun from Brooklyn, and we became good friends. We would chat for hours online, sometimes late into the night. She told me about her work as a missionary in the Philippines her love of modern art, and her collection of Pope John Paul II memorabilia. It's John. I told her about my hobby of baking apple pies. I worried that all this late night chatting would interfere with my hobbies. And I was right. I had to cut down on baking apple pies and focus on my job as a dairy supervisor. But. You know what they say, when God closes a door, he opens a window. So I did call her, and it was Lucinda. Hello, Gertie. Guess what? I'm coming to St. Mary's. Well, that's great. Wow. Uh, when? Why? I'm learning how to make cheese. No. I'm teaching my class the art of cheese making as part of our Great Tastes of the States unit. Oh, cheese, <laughs> cheese. Oh, we love our cheeses. <laughs> Wait, when are you coming? Yeah, I'm gonna be staying at a Silver Lake convent, which is about 20 minutes from you. Would you show me your dairy? Sure. I would love to, it, it would be lovely. Okay, bye. Lucinda and I got along quite famously. We talked about everything from swing dancing to cheese curds. This is a nice place. It's um my first time here. It's still a nice place. You know, the ambiance. Where did you get that rosary? <laughs> it suits you. Um, it was my grandmother's family heirloom. It's beautiful. Sometimes you just need a little something to hold on to. Mm -hmm. 
Pretty sure that it was Matthew. Uh, Lucinda, I think you know that it was Luke. <laughs> I like your shoes. Mm, this split pea soup is really yummy. <laughs> the flavor is extraordinary. It must be um, peas. <laughs> After lunch, I showed Lucinda the dairy farm. So this is your roommate, Beatrice? It is. Hi. Here I am. Sporty. Yeah, she's committed. <laughs> is she training for something? Triathlon. Oh, wow, that's amazing. Yeah. Give it a try. Come on, you're going to be amazing. Yeah. You're going to be a dirty piece. Just try it. Here, hold my hand. All right, it'll make it easier. Here we go. Come on. Step, match it, step, step. <laughs> Afterwards, Lucinda walked me to my room. Those cheese curds were fantastic. <laughs> They're best when they squeak. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I've heard. Well, I should probably say goodnight here. My roommate, Beatrice, does her push-ups early in the morning. <laughs> well, Gertrude, it was a wonderful day. It was really great meeting you, finally. <laughs> Don't be a stranger. I'm here only two more days. I have to do some work on my lesson plans. Oh, I understand. <laughs> well, good night. Good night, Rich. <laughs> Goodbye. Lucy, don't forget to save time for one more dance. how close I felt to Lucinda. I've never really had a friend like that. Lucinda? Well, thanks for calling me, Gertie. Well, I just couldn't bear the thought of you leaving without seeing our vintage statues. <laughs> of course. 
Uh, how about some ice cream? <laughs> you read my mind. Forgive me, Father, for I've sinned. Tell me, sister, I'm here for you. Well, the whole story is on this video. But the worst transgression was... Gertie. Gertrude, remember that God forgives the repentant. But Father, I thought... You're a great servant, Gertrude. I don't have to resign. Good night, sister. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. Mother Superior, I appreciate everything that you've done for me. I have loved my life here. I'm gonna miss you. Guess what? I'm coming to St. Mary's. Lovely. But I wanted you to know what happened. And I wanted you to hear it from me.